हेलो फ्रेंड्स आज हम एक नई चीज़ सीखने वाले हैं कि हम सोचते हैं कि ये केमिकल रिएक्शंस होती कैसे हैं मतलब दो रिएक्टेंट्स आते हैं या उनमें क्या इंटरेक्शन होता है एक दूसरे को क्यों अटैक करता है दूसरा अटैक करके क्यों लेता है एट्सेट्रा एट्सेट्रा बहुत सारे सवाल हमारे मन में आते हैं सो so, उसके कुछ जवाब देने की हम कोशिश करेंगे यहाँ पे तो वी नो दैट अ सबस्ट्रेट मॉलिक्यूल सबस्ट्रेट यानी जिसको कोई अटैक करने वाला है उसको हम कहते हैं सबस्ट्रेट सबस्ट्रेट इज अटैक्ड बाय अ रीएजेंट अटैकिंग रीएजेंट एंड देन अ प्रोडक्ट इज फॉर्म नाउ फॉर मी इट इज़ वेरी इजी टू राइट कि सबस्ट्रेट को अटैकिंग रिएजेंट अटैक करेगा एंड विल गेट द प्रोडक्ट्स लेकिन ये प्रोडक्ट फॉर्म होने तक देर आर सो मेनी डिफरेंट थिंग्स गोइंग ऑन इन दैट केमिकल रिएक्शन सो फर्स्ट वी विल ट्राई टू फाइंड आउट विच आर द अटैकिंग रिएजेंट्स वाई दीज रिएजेंट्स अटैक द सबस्टेट मॉलिक्यूल और देर मे बी लाइक इंट्रैक्शन बिटवीन टू सबस्टेट मॉलिक्यूल वन विल बी अटैकिंग द अदर वन सो उसके हिसाब से टर्मिनोलॉजी विल ऑल्सो बी डिफरेंट बट इन जनरल ए सबस्टेट मॉलिक्यूल इज अटैक्ट बाय एन अटैकिंग रिएजेंट एंड यू गेट द प्रोडक्ट्स नाउ ये अटैकिंग रिएजेंट में फर्स्ट सीरीज में आते हैं एन इलेक्ट्रोफाइल एंड अ न्यूक्लियोफाइल एन इलेक्ट्रोफाइल एंड अ न्यूक्लियोफाइल वट इज एन इलेक्ट्रोफाइल इलेक्ट्रोफाइल डिनोटेड बाय ई प्लस इट इज इलेक्ट्रॉन लविंग स्पीसीज इलेक्ट्रॉन लविंग स्पीसीज इलेक्ट्रोफाइल फाइल लवर ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन्स सो इट इज इलेक्ट्रॉन लविंग स्पीसीज Now, which species will like electrons? The one which is deficient in electrons. So, this species should be deficient in electrons, and it wants electrons for whatever purpose: completing the octet, attain stability, etc. And hence, it will always attack electron-rich centers. यानी सबस्टेट मॉलिक्यूल में जहाँ पे इलेक्ट्रॉन रिच सेंटर्स होंगे इट विल ऑलवेज अटैक द इलेक्ट्रॉन रिच सेंटर्स सो व्हाट आर द इलेक्ट्रोफाइल्स पॉजिटिव आयोन्स नॉर्मली आर इलेक्ट्रोफाइल्स यू नो पॉजिटिव आयोन्स मीन्स दे आर डेफिशिएंट इन इलेक्ट्रॉन्स सो पॉजिटिव आयोन्स लाइक एच प्लस सी एल प्लस बी आर प्लस सी एच थ्री एटसेट्रा आर इलेक्ट्रोफाइल्स बट All positive species are not electrophiles. Remember that. For example, how is NH4 plus molecule formed? Do you know? In NH4 plus molecule, this is NH3 molecule which is having a lone pair of electrons. The lone pair of electrons, whereas H plus doesn't contain any electron. so when they form a bond between them which is also called as coordinate covalent bond that is a covalent bond in which the pair of electrons which is shared between both of them is contribution of only one of the atom here in this case it is nitrogen and hence this electron pair is taken by hydrogen in the formation of nh4 plus and since it is taken by hydrogen there will be no electron rich sent and uh, no acceptance of electron it will not require electron because h plus ki jo duplet ki demand thi wo complete ho gayi n ki octet ki demand thi wo bhi complete ho gayi to now they do not require therefore nh4 plus will not act as a electrophile same is the case with h2o plus this will also not act as a electrophile in special special conditions they can act as electrophile like if nh4 aqueous solution we have prepared it will dissociate as nh3 plus uh, nh3 minus and h plus in that case it will act as a electrophile so the point to remember is that 
all positive species are not electrophiles but all electrophile all electro some electrophiles may be positive species again what is an electrophile as we discussed electrophile is one which requires electrons so bf3 or becl2 or alcl3 if you note in this one all of them are having less than 8 electrons when the molecule is formed in their outermost orbit as they have less than 8 electrons they can accommodate a pair of electrons they can take electrons and thus they also can act as electrophiles so what do we call them we call them as incomplete octets the molecules neutral molecules hai ye in pe koi charge nahi hai but in may octet complete nahi hai so such molecules can also accept electrons and hence they can act as electrophiles further this is a free radical free radical will discuss what is free radical but remember that on this free radical there is only one electron that is outermost orbit of carbon contains seven electrons not eight electrons hence this carbon will demand an electron to complete its octet and therefore as it accepts an electron it will also act as an electrophile so ch3 dot is also electrophile dot ka matlab hai electron again lewis acids what are lewis acids all those species which can accept a pair of electrons are called as lewis acids so here lewis acids since they can accept pair of electrons therefore lewis acids are also electrophiles again a point to note is that all lewis acids are electrophiles but all electrophiles are not lewis acid क्यों सोचिए लेविस एसिड में उनको क्या चाहिए अ पेयर ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन्स यानी दो इलेक्ट्रॉन्स चाहिए अगर पेयर नहीं मिला लेते हैं वो तो देन दे आर नॉट कॉल्ड एज लेविस एसिड तो ये एग्जांपल देखो कि ये सी एच थ्री जो है ये हमने देखा इलेक्ट्रोफाइल है लेकिन ये लेविस एसिड नहीं है बिकॉज इट एक्सेप्ट ओनली वन इलेक्ट्रॉन एंड लेविस एसिड रिक्वायर अ पेयर ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन्स दैट्स वाई आई सेड ऑल लेविस एसिड्स आर इलेक्ट्रोफाइल्स बट ऑल इलेक्ट्रोफाइल लाइक दिस इलेक्ट्रोफाइल इज नॉट अ लेविस एसिड सो ये पॉइंट नोट करना है कि ऑल पॉजिटिव स्पेसिस आर नॉट इलेक्ट्रोफाइल्स एंड ऑल लेविस एसिड्स आर इलेक्ट्रोफाइल्स बट ऑल इलेक्ट्रोफाइल्स आर नॉट लेविस एसिड्स Similarly, or कौन electrophile uh, can act as electrophile? So the polar functional groups. What are polar functional groups? Polarity. Polarity develops when there is a difference of electronegativity between the bonding atoms. So here, C double bond O. carbon and oxygen oxygen is more electronegative than carbon therefore this bond is a polar bond and this functional group oxygen will carry negative charge carbon will pos carry positive charge so carbon is deficient in electrons so carbon will act as an electrophile and oxygen will act as a nucleophile similarly c triple bond then here nitrogen will act as nucleophile and carbon is carrying a positive charge so we will act as an electrophile so if we list what are electrophiles electrophiles are deficient in electrons therefore they are electro loving electron loving species and therefore they will always attack the electron rich centers positive ions are normally electrophiles excluding some positive ions which do not require electrons lewis acids are electrophiles polar molecules are electrophiles and again all those neutral molecules which do not have eight electrons in their outermost orbit that is they have incomplete octet they can also accept a pair of electron they are also called as electrophiles 
so you understand electrophiles all type of electrophiles we have taken into consideration exactly opposite to that we have nucleophiles nucleophile jaise electrophile ka matlab electron loving species hai वैसे न्यूक्लियोफाइल का मतलब है न्यूक्लियस लविंग स्पीसीज नॉ न्यूक्लियस लविंग स्पीसीज मतलब न्यूक्लियस में कौन सा चार्ज होता है ऑब्वियसली पॉजिटिव चार्ज देर फॉर न्यूक्लियस लविंग स्पीसीज मीन्स दे रिक्वायर पॉजिटिव दे आर इलेक्ट्रॉन रिच स्पीसीज एंड दे पॉजिटिव चार्ज they like positive charge and therefore they will always they are electron rich and they will always attack the positive centers or those centers which have less electrons because they want to donate electrons so which are nucleophiles the nu neutral molecules which have a lone pair of electrons a lone pair of electrons for example h2o one or more lone pair of electrons so in h2o molecule there are two lone pairs of electrons in nh3 molecule there is one lone pair of electron in alcohol ph3 r nh2 all the species are such that they have a lone pair of electron and hence they can act as nucleophile because they are electron pair donors similarly expanded octets expanded octets like sf6 pcl5 in sf6 how many bonds are there six bonds therefore how many electrons are there 12 electrons in pcl5 five bonds therefore number of electrons are 10 and hence these are called as expanded octets that is they contain greater than 8 electrons and as they contain greater than 8 electrons they can act as nucleophile they can donate electrons to other species again lewis base exactly opposite to lewis acids we have lewis bases lewis bases are electron pair donors these these are also lewis bases so electron pair donors hai means they like to donate the pair of electrons and since they can donate electrons they are nucleophiles similarly organometallic compounds what are all organometallic compounds when there is a bond between organic carbon and a metal like magnesium zinc etc so such compounds are called as organometallic compounds now the most important organometallic compound in organic chemistry is rmgx famously called as grignard's reagent grignard's reagent so this is organometallic compound what do you see that in organometallic compound there is a bond between carbon and metal metal metals as you know are electro positive in nature hence the bond is a polar bond with metal carrying positive charge and carbon carrying negative charge and hence this carbon can act as a nucleophile similarly the molecules which have double bond or triple bonds that is we can say that they contain pi electrons you are well versed with the fact that when a double bond is formed between two atoms we even discuss sigma and pi bonds so in double bond one is a sigma bond another is a pi bond so and also you know that pi pair of electrons is delocalized that is it is weak and it can be easily delocalized so all such species which contain pi electrons like ch2 double bond ch2 ch triple bond ch and benzene molecule because benzene molecule contains three pi pairs of electron and hence these can also act as nucleophiles 
तो न्यूक्लियोफाइल्स कौन कौन होते हैं निगेटिव स्पीसीज दे कैन बी पोलर मॉलिक्यूल्स दे कैन बी ऑर्गेनो मेटेलिक कंपाउंड्स दे कैन बी लेविस बेसिस बिकॉज दे कैन डोनेट अ पेयर ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन्स एंड पाई इलेक्ट्रॉन रिच स्पेसिस सो दीज आर ऑल न्यूक्लियोफाइल्स नाउ वी नो दैट दीज आर अटैकिंग रिएजेंट्स इलेक्ट्रोफाइल विल ऑलवेज अटैक इलेक्ट्रॉन रिच सेंटर एंड न्यूक्लियोफाइल विल ऑलवेज अटैक इलेक्ट्रॉन डेफिशियंट सेंटर and how these centers are formed by fission of the bond we will see in our next video which we call as homolytic fission heterolytic fission in general breaking of bond fission of bonds that we will see in our next lecture revise karte rahiye naye naye cheeze dhoondte rahiye and padhte rahiye so we'll see in the next lecture